Good morning, welcome to day two on our Isle of Skye adventure. Today we need to drive from here, Fort William, and these beautiful surroundings and the park up that we found last night, all the way to Malay, which is where we get our ferry, and we need to be there by 5 p.m., because that's when we kind of need to be there to check in. Along the way, we need to find one, a Harry Potter bridge, and that's called Glenfinnan Viaduct. And then just behind that bridge, I've seen this really cool isolated little island on the lake there, on the lock. So hopefully we're gonna get the canoe out and we're gonna canoe out to that little island. And we're gonna do all of that whilst having time to drive from here to Malay, which is about two hours away. So we better get to it. It's time for breakfast. Let's go. And on today's breakfast menu, we've got some, what do you make, Jazz? You don't know, do you? <laughs> um, Oats, banana, apple, peanut butter, and honey. And they are super yummy too. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> I've been doing the washing up while she's been cooking, so don't you go get any ideas. <laughs> I am the boss. <laughs> I'm here, I am. <laughs> Just asked you to pass me the camera, and as I was doing so, decided to throw my coffee all over myself and the floor. Didn't want it, didn't fancy I your coffee this morning. Oh dear. Anyway, so it's gonna make me need a poop, so. <laughs> sake. Well, just before I threw coffee all over myself and the van, I was, oh look, it's like a wood stain. Look, that'll be nice. That'll be really good. Yeah, oh, yippee. <laughs> I forgot what I was even gonna say. I was gonna say, we're gonna have two cups of regulator because I was gonna say it makes you regular. Haha, <laughs> that was gonna be my funny joke, but clearly not, because it's on the floor. Um, and then we're gonna get on our way because we need to get going. Dad is cleaning the coffee up, shock. Nine o'clock, let's get moving. Out. Colin McRae's at the bloody wheel. <laughs> I had to film some drone stuff, so I had to reluctantly give over the wheel oh, to, shut up. I'm a good driver. to the rally driver. <laughs> this is a bit rookie like this. <laughs> To Glenfinnan Glen 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 Viaduct because there wasn't any parking spaces, so we're going to do that on the way home. So we just popped to Dumbledore's grave, which is just here. <laughs> so for any Harry Potter fans, it's probably cooler than uh, cooler than the Viaduct anyway. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and as Yai went to get the recording equipment out of the van because it was raining when we first got here, I saw Rose. some smoke of the train coming, so I hollered him and. We got a really, really super cool drone video and camera video, hopefully, of the train going past um, Dumbledore's grave and round the lake. So that's pretty cool. That was actually very cool. I didn't speak to you on the camera because I was far too busy flapping, <laughs> trying to get the drone up, trying to fly, trying to capture some videos. Um, but yeah, as Jazz said, I went to the went to the car to get the camera because it had just stopped raining. It's like nice, we can get some footage. And then the bloody train come past and neither of us were expecting it. So, and I've never seen the Harry Potter train before, nor is Jazz, that's what we wanted to see. Uh, so that was awesome. Very jealous of all the people that were on it because I tried to book. If you ever want to go on the Harry Potter train, you can book it and go and sit on there. Um, but I tried to book and it is booked for the entire year, every single day, including all of the economy, like cheapest tickets you could possibly book and all of the most expensive tickets. I looked at buying like a full suite and it was completely booked out. So yeah, that's for next year. So if you want to book it, you have to look for next year's tickets. But I think now that we've done, we've ticked both boxes, found the Harry Potter train and we found Dumbledore's cave. We didn't go and see Glenfin and, Glen and Vida because it's absolutely rammed. So we'll go and look at it another day, but we're gonna go make our way towards Malay now because there's lots of really pretty stops on the way. So we're gonna find a really pretty park up by a lock, make some lunch, give the doggies their lunch, 
and then we're gonna make our way to the ferry. See ya. Found the train again. <laughs> what a day we've had. We might not have got to the Viaduct, but we found the train. Come on. Well, we made it to Malay, <laughs> finally. It's a beautiful little seaside town, really. It's actually very busy. I imagine if you come in the middle of summer, it's gonna be rammed, because there was barely any parking spaces here now, and it's raining and in the middle of July, and kids aren't off school yet, so I think we're getting very lucky. We've taken the dogs for a little walk. Now we're gonna pop into town, we're gonna get some lunch before we get our ferry tonight, so we'll see you guys after we've had some food. So cool in here. Look at that. We must be fun. Ball the ball. <laughs> Free porter. Welcome to Hogwarts Witchcraft and Witchcraft. Uh, I do like these Christmas decorations too, they're, they're really cool. Yeah, look, there they are. They're 14 99 as well, not bad. Oh yeah, real cheap. That's cheap. <laughs> Where are we at, boss? We are in Malaig, waiting for the ferry. You're very quiet. We are in Malaig. <laughs> <laughs> We're in Malaig, waiting for the ferry over to Sky. And I've just found out that there's some showers in Sky that are open until 10 p.m. so I can have a shower and wash my hair. Woohoo! I'm so excited. We're just about to jump on the ferry and it looks okay. So far, nothing's gone wrong today. Has it? Don't jinx it, no. No. We didn't get to Glenfinn and Viaduct. Oh, yeah, but other than that. But we found the Harry Potter train, which is what we wanted to do. We found Dumbledore's grave. We're going to hop on this ferry. Once we get over to the other side, we're going to head to a park up. And Jazz has found some toilets and showers that we can pay like a pound for. Uh, so we can actually have a hot shower tonight. Jazz is awesome. Hey. Eating alive by midges. Oh, yeah. I have about 15 bites on my face. <laughs> Right, see you on the ferry. Right, you ready or not? She's gonna cry now. Are you ready now? Hey. Are you ready? Ow! <laughs> 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 yes, I am. I have just head the car. Hmm, I was trying to wind her up. We're on the ferry. Let's go to Sky, baby! So, um, I haven't actually been on the ferry since I was 10 and I get car sick, so let's see how we get on. <laughs> no, what did you say at the end? I might be sick on your own. managed to get to our end destination or kind of end destination here on day two Jazz's favorite location of probably the whole trip we managed to find these showers on park for night that are I think like a pound for two minutes or something okay. um, so we, we we figured it out that as long as we spend less than 25 pound it's cheaper than going to a campsite which is basically where we'd end up going if we wanted showers and stuff anyway so <laughs> so even if we spend 10 quid in the shower it's still cheaper than going to a campsite <laughs> My top off now. She's so excited, it's ridiculous. So let's go have a shower. Well excited. Well, I must say that was probably one of the best shower experiences as far as basically camping <laughs> that I've ever had. We paid, it was a pound for two minutes. They're extremely clean. The toilets are in there as well. You literally have like a whole booth to yourself. It's, it's 
brilliant, brilliant idea. They should do it in the UK. They should do it in England more. That's why we love Scotland. What do you reckon, yeah. boss? Good. Hundred percent. I love Scotland because I can have a nice warm shower. Right. Now we're off to go make our dinner and get to our park up, and then we'll say good night to you guys. Let's go. And that is day two done. We've ticked off everything on our list. We found all of the Harry Potter places. We've got over to Sky successfully. We've had a shower and we found this lovely car cut, which we're gonna now make our dinner and slowly go to bed. So we will see you guys tomorrow where we are off for a very exciting adventure. So make sure you join us. See you then.